Hi and welcome to Collie Gallery to this fantastic exhibition here with Benign and his friends Teach, Sigboy, Lucy Flynn, Voider and Howard Nozem. I'm Ben Iron, street artist and retired graffiti writer and I am here as I have a show at Collie Gallery with some very dear and talented friends. It was an opportunity to get a bunch of like dear friends and yeah amazing artists together and I don't think any of us have shown in Zurich before. So open up the Zurich mindset to kind of what these talented people do in their little places around the world. It's a fantastic, colorful and vibrant exhibition. It's entitled Love at First Sight. What is love at first sight? Like, you know, you see something or you see someone and you're just like, wow. I think it's an amazing phrase that sums up emotions and feelings in people. And it definitely conjures up something in me. And we hope to spark this to all of Zurich. This is Ben Ein and you can see this amazing wall of stencils. We chose to represent these artworks because they really show the process of working, but they're all unique. Then on the other side you have also the canvases that show again another kind of perspective into Ben Ein's um, artistic practice. These are the artworks of Howard Nozem. They are very famous for the huge murals that are very intricate. And you can see also their graphic detail, but also their radiance uh, when you really look close at the artworks. It's very impressive how they mix graphic design and imagery and um, very intricate storytelling. This is Voider. He is a British artist that started with graffiti in his youth. When he got bored of the graffiti and style writing, he decided to go into traditional painting with oil as well. He did landscape, portraiture, as well as still life. After experiencing graffiti as well as traditional painting, he had the idea to put this together in one work. And this is the results that we see now at the Collie Gallery. With Teach, you can discover again an artist that is really focusing on lettering, but also the abstraction. We are lucky enough to exhibit works that are complementing lettering as well as abstract. And his technique on steel is very unique. You see it not that often in artworks, but it gives really a different kind of look. Sick Boy's painting are very exciting, they are colorful and kind of surrealistic. You can recognize very different color radiance as well as that you can recognize a juxtaposition between figurative as well as abstract. Uh, you can always discover more in the paintings the longer you look at them. Once we leave and the show comes down and all the paintings go off to their new homes, Zurich still has a huge, great big love at first sight painting, which is amazing. And hopefully people are going to like it and yeah, hopefully it will live for a while. <laughs>